this march for science is really essential for the scientific community to come out, to come out of its ivory towers and to be present in the many national and international debates which are affecting our societies and our future. So I hope there will be many of you who will join me in marching here in Maastricht or wherever in the world in your different cities. Why do I believe so much that this March for Science is essential today? Well, for sure, because there are many issues about evidence-based and there are many issues about preventing scientists to come out. But if there is something characteristic of scientific activity, it's because it's open, it's transparent, it's self-regulating, and it has survived those many hundreds of years by continuously self-regulating itself and by being an activity which is accepted and which is trusted by society and by our citizens. So rather than sitting within the protected environment of our laboratories in the ivory towers with our peer assessments being guaranteed excellence to, our peer, to this peer assessment, it's time now to come out and to be part of the agora, the meeting place where we meet citizens, where we meet politicians, where we meet traders, businesses, etc., and to make our points about the importance of science in the many global challenges our societies are confronted with. I hope you will join me and be there.